Got him. So, hello. Welcome back to another episode here. We are at a bass pond and slash carp pond. And it's really good carp fishing here. And, uh, yeah, we're going to give her a full send out here. My key's in a safe place. And we got, we just went to Walmart, which is literally right up there. It's that building right there. And, uh, yeah, got a couple cans of corn. We're ready to go fishing. So, I might start out bass fishing, though, just to see if there's any greenbacks in the area. And then do that, I'm going to use my PB catching special on the Ned rig. So, we're going to get that set up. A little bulky, but hey, that's our setup. That's our setup for finding bias. Let's get started. I'm gonna parallel the shore. Some weeds. Go out that way. That's a good spot. Got him that time. I'm hooked up. I'm hooked up, boys. This was small. Don't pop off. I don't know. Oh, it's a spunky. Spunky little fish. Come on. Come over here. Wow, that's a spunky little one. Yo. Whoa. Okay, I'll loosen the drag a little bit. This thing's pulling. I like it. I like the attitude of this fish. I've heard there's some big ones in here. This is a good start. Oh, there we go. There we go. Right where I like to put them too. Corner of the mouth. Typical circle hook placement. And there we go. First fish of the day. Hopefully the smallest one we're going to catch. Because, like I said, heard there's some big ones. And uh, this isn't really proving me right. So here you go. Oh, super spunky though. They're on that fall bite. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. There's a bite. Dish on. Drag screen. This might be a better one. There we go. Upgraded. That's an upgrade. Come on. Come here, buddy. Alright. Thank you. There you go. About one pounder. We upgraded a little bit on the carp size. So he's going back. Off. Oh. Got him. I think we upgraded, boys. He's coming up. He's coming up. He's coming up. Oh, there we go. Okay, maybe downgraded just a tad. This, oh, God. There we go. See ya. Okay, not much to show for that guy. Well, I was a bit preoccupied. I was actually talking on the phone, and uh, yeah, here we go. Oh, this is fat. This is a... We downgraded a little bit, but in girth. That's a good one. <laughs> Good little girthy fish. Circle hook right in the top of the mouth. Interesting. All right, there you go. Easy, easy fish. See you, bud. Eat it. Got him. Got a fish. Yes. Yep, this is what's over there. Hey, finally got one. Oh, man. Ate the gulp minnow. About time. Yeah, this one swam off to the side with it. I thought y'all was going to miss him. But yeah, there we go. First gill of the day. That's good. Good little good little fish there. Second species. See you, bud. Woo! Ooh. Right. What the? Okay, I think this is big. Oh, yeah, this is big. Yep, this is our last fish here. Actually, wait. What the? What are you doing? This fish is acting funny. You have to be for one second now, it feels like a dink. Oh, be a decent one. Oh yeah, that's pretty decent. Ah, it's about a pound and a half. Come on. Yeah, it's about a two pounder. Crap. Biggest fish of the day. That's perfect fish to end on this spot. There you go. Nice. Two pounder. Biggest fish of the day. Go back. Nice. <clears throat> Let's go. I'm just going to flip these sticks and see if there's any gills. Fish. Got him. What is that? Greeny? It's greeny. Yeah, he choked it. There he is. Threw back in there. And got him. 
There you go, first green of the day, third species of fish. What the flip? There's a guy throwing stuff in the water. Okay, see ya. What is he throwing? Look at that dude. I'm glad I moved. Just got some really strange news in all this fog. Um, about, I don't know, there's a town like probably 30 minutes from here that says to have a tornado on the ground. And there's no, there's no sign of any sort of storm near us. Like, this is, it's just fog over here. So, uh, crap. But it said it should, I probably still have about 30 minutes, but it doesn't look, there's no dark clouds or anything, which is kind of weird. So, I don't know, we might be experiencing some weird weather, boys. We're flipping this tree for some bias. Oh, I just pulled something big. There's a fish there. There's something there. So, quick update for you guys. It's been about 30 minutes, and uh, my phone decided to stop recording. So, just wanted to update y'all. Broke off on a carp. Had one on, but he just got me wrapped up on something way out there. And so, had to tie on a snell. And then getting a few bites on the gold minnow here. Oh, did I just get bit? I think I just got bit. Go! Go! Get up! Go! I think I got him. He's small. Nope. Is he? Yeah, he's pretty small. Average sized. Okay. He's not getting any stuck in those weeds. Get up in there. Yes. So good to catch. Oh, they're a little bit colder over here. Well, sorry I just cut out like you on that uh, fish, but yeah, my phone's being really, really stupid. Just missed another fish and uh, kicked my shoe off while getting the mud off. Oh, 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 there's a bite. But yeah, carp's starting to pick up, and I uh, probably got about 15 minutes before they say the effects of the tornadic storm is supposed to come. But there's no dark clouds. It just looks the same all the way around, which is weird, but I don't know. We'll find out. Should have known. Crap. I had something big on, or something bigger, than, slightly bigger than this. You know, I thought it was a bass. Threw back in there with that little gulp minnow. And how about that? Caught me a... Oh, nice bluegill. Oh. Little. There's a nice gill for you. See you, bud. Last fish of the day. And it is a beauty. This carp is so dark. Oh, look at how. That is so pretty. Oh my gosh. That is a pretty, pretty fish. Look at that. Look how dark he is. That is a crazy dark carp. Must have been in the shallows. I don't know. He's ever been out deep. He's been in one of the two. I don't know. I don't know if it's darker fish or out deeper. I had no clue. But it's a nice fish nonetheless. He's going to go back. Alright. Well, thank you for watching this episode of Shake at the Lake here. Very fun episode. Haven't been here in forever. And it turned out to be a great day. So leave a like and drop a comment. And subscribe, of course. We're at number 69. I actually... It's going to be my shout out. So I know I had three subscribers since the last video. And, uh, well, crap, I don't, they didn't come in. The names didn't come in. So I have no idea who subscribed. So I'm just going to give a shout out to the 67th, 68th, and the 69th subscriber. So, yeah, freaking dope, man. Thank you for watching. And I'm going to leave, and uh, we'll see you next time.